As they did. It's fucking tunic off. They're gonna do that too. Give you time to respawn. Immortal end of scenario. Maybe Kyle's or Sergeant York's it and oh. that's all. Yeah. Maybe they were in there. Oh no, those are Canadians right there. Oh those are Canadians. Canadians. It looks oh, like it might be a German over here. Shot at one. <laughs> oh, <wait. laughs> well, our our advance. Yeah, that was good. People in the concealment here for the open field of fire here. I mean I didn't see this yesterday. I know, I was eating a bunch of them. Yes, sir, we didn't initially plan to uh, go uh, through here. I can't remember the whole property line was, but I'm pretty sure it's a little bit of a guy. It was a private property sign. Yeah, somebody here. I think it's a state. I don't worry about it. I say, who cares? These people probably don't care. Well, this state of that way, so. I think this is somewhere there, but. Let's we'll drag it back to these lines. <laughs> this is a cool place to fight, though. Yeah, it's definitely uh, hard gone. Yeah, a fellow would. But it would be better if we did it in like, late September or October. Yeah. Where if they would have. It'd be nice to do in deciduous forest, too. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Textile too. underbrush. Instead of, you know, Andor. <laughs> this was kind of, you know, thing. Well, I keep saying that this was originally supposed to be a training event, and then. Decided to turn into a battle, so it's like, well, now we gotta make trails. <laughs> well, that's, that's great. You know, like hasty fortifications. How long would they have had to dig in when they're falling back? Okay. Going right down for the dragon. Oh, the dragon. Oh, wait. It's just vodka. It's a whole can of vodka. <laughs> shedding their stuff, whether they have carried it, or mm -hmm. how would they have gone about with their equipment? They drop in your uh, moon clips. Yeah, yeah, I get it. Yeah, well my guess is, like, they knew what they were getting into. They are young, fit, and it's like, what's your primary thing? Well, thing alive. Yeah. Well, I mean, like, after. Oh, yeah. After action, or in between, kind of like what we're doing. Yeah. <laughs> I know my, my preference is definitely to get rid of the underlayer to keep the overlayer because this is where the pockets are. I love pockets. I don't think you're. I think it's supposed to be like it wasn't supposed to be anything in the pockets. They're just basically for show. Yeah. Well, Which is weird. Sure. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's why the patch pockets. Yeah. That's why I love the jumpsuit. Yeah. I think I lost two. Oh well. Always buy more. It is not the end of the world. Which I, I even know. Well, well, there's another one, so. The problem is the, the repro happens, which are horrible. They're like not hard and fast. They don't flex. There's going to be another one around here or it's somewhere in the bush. I was lucky to find that grenade. So. Somebody better done thank me for that one. We're dead, but if you walk up there with your helmet off, you could probably go down around the bend and hook yep. up with your people. I think some of them are still in that fortification there. Where they're at. Just yeah, follow the road up, up there at the top of the hill. Yeah. Like I said, yeah, just take your helmet off, walk up there, nobody's going to mess with you. If, if you want, you could check in with the uh, white shirt. The white shirt. Our little <laughs> referee. Referee, the ump. Oh, okay. What, what is this title again? OC. 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 I don't know. Operation Control. Where'd you find the uh, stick grenade? Oh, that was, they just threw us. Oh. I didn't want it to get lost in the bush, so I grabbed it. No, right. This one to Caleb's? I think so. I don't know who shot me. Somebody killed me. It wasn't the grenade that killed me, but they fucking busted. Huh. No, I've just been trying to find somebody that makes World War I grenades. That one just looks like a wooden doll with a paper can. I 
think oh, it's one of the ones he's got. I think the head pops. Yeah. Yeah. He, yeah. He was telling me about that last night. Had a little some kind of firecracker or something in there. Oh, there it is. It looks like it's coming out. At one point, when the squad's all dead, should the medics retreat? <laughs> right. Yeah. Keep hoping the guys that are waiting for will show up. They got all their gear in my like car. Right. Yeah. All German or anybody doing LS? Uh, I think that he is doing French. Do they know where to go? They're driving a jump truck. Yeah, that's not that's, that's, that's an LS. Oh, no, that's not that. <laughs> He's the one who dug our fortification yesterday. So. Pulling me, he's coming through with the fucking excavator. I'm like, oh, man, that's figure, a lot yeah. of tank. Well, <laughs> hopefully, if he's gonna drive up this road, that they can take the wire down. He's not gonna. Okay. okay. He's not gonna. <laughs> that would. Uh, well, he'd take out the wire. Oh, did they put wire across the road? Yeah, see it right there, the strand. Oh, okay, there. Yeah. yeah, I haven't. Since they put that up, I haven't been up here. Oh yeah. So let's get this shit back together and get on down the road. And the sergeant's is dead. Man, that's the longest I've seen a sergeant last. Yeah. Just like my battlefield one, KDR. Yeah. Or Sheriff to whack next to me like, that was a grenade, wasn't it? Yeah, that's how we got we, uh, we had a grenade land between us, but it was too far apart to really count as a kill. Right. So how long do you have to go before you can go back in? Or is it just... Oh, whenever you touch it. Yeah, I think you're supposed to go by a scenario, but normally okay. with AG-44, they go by, like, you know, five minutes when you get up. Uh, so I don't know how you officially want to do it. Jim's so. uh, running the show. So. Okay, I'm going to say this. I want to call him gas, but I really don't want to fucking wear this thing again. Jesus Christ. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, let's I gotta not talk do that until later in the day. When we're, when we're defending. Yeah, yeah, when we're defending, we'll fucking do it. Oh, oh, God. God. Yeah. Oh, I could wear the thing and sit there, <laughs> but trying to move it's uphill moved. through yeah, the no. thick brush. Yeah. I wasn't claustrophobic before, but I am now. It's and I thought I was, like, seeing things well, I'm like not I saw. Right. This is supposed to be an exhalation belt, and that looks solid to me. Yeah, it's just cosmetic. Mm -hmm. yeah, the whole thing is supposed to be hollow. Hey, yeah. Measure 10. What? What? Yeah. Honestly, I might just cut something out and give it a flow. So. Yeah, or maybe something cosmetic up in the yeah. your nose piece. Yeah. It's not like the. I mean, you can you can actually suffocate. This yeah. It's not. It's not like our Canucks put a slit in here for the exhalation valve, so it'll actually allow you to. So I'll have to look at what they modify. Yeah. Well, well, actually, it looks, it looks pretty good right here. It looks hollow enough, I think, because this is just one piece. Right? But I, I'm guessing if you put a little hole right there, it's not a It's like a pocket. I don't know. It's easier to replace We got bayonets? Oh, yeah. We're doing a bayonet. We're doing a lot of shit. That's right. I came equipped. Well, my, uh, my, 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 Probably turn the thing off now. <coughs> oh. <laughs> oh, no.